can't stop, won't stop. That seems to be the mantra of Daniel Bennett. The 41-year-old will represent Tampines Rovers once again in the upcoming Singapore Premier League season, driven as ever to succeed. All right, Dan, you are the oldest player in the SPL this season. Do you actually feel that you're old? Uh, I, I feel all this when I look at photos and I realize, hang, hang on, these guys are much younger than me. But when I'm on the field, you know, I feel, I feel strong, I feel good. So I've been lucky with injuries and uh, I enjoy it as much as ever. So I'm looking forward to 2019. So what feels that hunger and desire to keep competing at the highest level? I always want to be the best. I always want to compete in training. And if you're doing that and you're competitive, then I think that goes into the games. And I'd like to win another league, to be honest. Uh, I don't know what our breaks are like this year. <laughs> As you say, their, their goalkeeper is gone and he was a big influence, I think, on the team. So uh, hopefully we, we have a good chance and you no know, other teams can compete as well this year. A fourth place finish isn't acceptable at a club like Tampines Rovers. Is a fresh approach exactly what is needed this season? I think the biggest difficulty during the holiday for me was to accept what happened at the end of last season. We were all really disappointed and I think we were, we were happy. It was a long holiday this time because it's, it's given us time to get over that. For Tampines, fourth place is, is not good enough, like you say, and we're working hard to to put things right and I think we've got a good young team. Uh, we, we have some talented young players. Of course it's, it's, it's compulsory that we play three under 23 players and and we've got to make sure that those players are, are competitive and and uh, ready to go just like the senior players. Are. The club has placed its faith in recruiting several youngsters this season. Do you enjoy playing the role of role model and mentoring these players? I, I enjoy, um, yeah, I enjoy talking to them, but I enjoy when they ask me questions and, and they're willing to, to learn because uh, if they are, they can, they can improve a lot. Um, I hope that, that the batch we have are willing to put themselves about. In training, it's every man for themselves. It doesn't matter if you're old or you're, old or you're young. So, I just, I just hope that the batch we have now are willing to, to show themselves. Yes, they have to show respect to the older players, but we need them to, to work hard and we need them to compete for a place and not just accept maybe that they're going to be on the bench. And I have to ask you this, there will be a new national team coach in charge in 2019. Do you still harbour hopes of adding to that 142 caps? Well, I, I never retired, but you know, I, I, I think the boys in the Suzuki Cup this year, they did well. Uh, Safwan is obviously outstanding and now he's playing in the, the best position. Irfan also, he, he, he's coming on slowly and, and I think they're going to form a good partnership. So now, unless they needed me for, for whatever reason, then I'm happy to, to sit in the stands and support them now.